we're going to create a hyperlink in a user form. So as usual, I want to start with a button. user form yet these aren't capitalized but insert user form user form one let's make a button a button button and a label there we go now I want to get a mouse cursor before we do anything see this here I'll have this on I'll have this link down there. It's a. Uh, we're just gonna download, save it. And what that is. It is. The hand cursor. I'll show you why we need that. So we got command button one. Now, all we're gonna do is we're just gonna link to a file. So we're gonna say. Dim, s, as string s equals uh, application get open file name now we're going to say label 1 equals s okay so when we run it okay and button 1 now uh, let's just say this thing comes here. Now we'll just close it. Now let's go to the properties for this. Label one. Let's go to font. Font. You know, if you want to change the font. So that's the, you know, choose thing. Now here, okay, because what happens now, it's not a very colored, good blue, is it? Let's find a better blue. Palette. Blue. There you go. So we go here. See how the mouse doesn't change when we go over here? That's why I downloaded that mouse. So we're going to set this customize, and we're going to find where you downloaded. Okay, it was called hand and curve. Here we go. Now, let's see what happens. Go here that guy and now when you go here it turns into the hand see yeah so now they have a one click active or look follow hyperlink address and it's going to be me label one new window equals true nope address wrong what did I do wrong open point oh equals okay now here. Okay. That guy. Now when you click on it, I'll give you that, but it will open that file for you. And on load the 
if you, if you have a smart indenter, you can indent it too. Now let's try this. That's the one we just opened. go. So when you go here, oh, when you're in the labels property, mouse pointer, set it to 99 for custom, and mouse icon, find your file. Okay. Thanks for watching.